Just before noontime, flames shot out of the roof of 57 West 7th Street, and state police trooper William Fitzmaurice saw it and started rushing floor to floor to get residents out. There were no injuries, due in part to quick action. You were in the shower, and what did you hear? What happened? Couple rings on the bell and uh, get out. The firefight focused on a section of roof set up with patio furniture, fencing, plants, and flower pots. Fire investigators say someone carelessly disposed of a cigarette in a planter that caused the blaze and a lot of damage. A heavy fire uh, on the roof of 57 West 7th Street, uh, and the fire extended to both 55 and 59. These are all three deckers. Uh, this particular building, 57, uh, their condo units. McDonald, also driving by, called in the fire, but didn't have the address until the trooper also got on the radio. Mostly uh, surface damage, uh, but the roof uh, is pretty well gone on the back half of uh, 57. Only third floor residents have access to the roof. They didn't want to talk about the accidental fire. Neighbors on the first floor, very concerned. Yeah, I just ran home from work because my boyfriend called me and said our house was on fire. I didn't even tell them I was leaving work. I just ran out the door. <laughs> you can see the exposure damage and do not use a planter as an ashtray. That's the message from fire officials. They're also concerned. You can see there's a barbecue grill with a propane tank on two of the decks and you cannot have a propane tank above the first floor for safety reasons. That's what the fire department wants to get out tonight. Wasn't an issue in this case, but a good reminder. Live in South Boston, Rondella Richardson, WCBB News Center 5.